All right. First time you're powering this up, so key pops, plus five, push the power switch, tell it to welcome, then turn it on. And the first thing you want to do is the language is going to be wrong, so the joystick, go to the left, and then go down for two seconds. So when it says menu, go down for two seconds, minimum. And then the first thing you see is language. And hit, push the button in, scroll down to English, push the button in, and it says setting clock, push the button in, set the time, it's 12 hour clock, minutes, and we set the units, push the button in, and scroll down to miles, push the button in, U.S. gallons, that's fine, and the last one, you know, U.S., and then temperature changes to Fahrenheit, so down, and then push in, backlight, you can change three different levels of it, not necessary, and back to language, and you can allow it to time out, or just turn the ignition off and we'll keep it. So at this point, goodbye. So it's turned off, we push the button again, it says welcome, turn the ignition on. And some of the other things you could do, if you go to the right, it goes between trip A, the total, and and trip B, and also so it shows your trip time, and the reset these trip odometers is already zero, just keep on holding for about two seconds to the right. And if you go to the left, it goes between voltage, menu setting, miles per gallon, your average miles per gallon, and so miles per gallon is the, the running when you're operating it, and your distance to empty, Average miles per hour, which is zero max miles per hour, and back to voltage. So you can cycle through several of those, including the menu. But to enter the menu, you gotta go down for two seconds. And then you go to the average. And you go up or down to set, set the different things clock, units, backlight, language, back to that. So. That's all the functions of this uh, programming, that's all you get.